Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, we're gonna take a look at the atomic shop, see what we got there, and uh, at the daily challenges, see what we gotta do in order to make some score. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. All right, so first thing first, let's navigate to the atomic shop and see what we got today. So today we've got. We need to scroll all the way to the right, and we got the alien plushie. 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 I hate this word. Oh, man. There we go. Well, I want to have a collection, so I'm going to grab it. Down to 1,630 atoms. <laughs> Alright, so uh, this is what we have today. I'm going to grab it because I want to have a collection of these toys. And let's go and check out what we got for the uh, challenges. So for the challenges, we got buy, buy or sell an item from another player, chew bubble gum, complete uh, an event twice, drink a Nuka Cola three times, gold star complete daily challenge, do any of the following, and you will get it done automatically. Join a group with another player, kill a cryptid, kill a scourge, level up, mod a weapon three times, and take a photo on nuclear winter. Okay, that's cool. You can do that in the lobby and log out. <laughs> so, uh, these are all very pretty much easy and straightforward, but for those who do not know or would like some help with these, let me explain you how to complete them. For those who know, already know how to complete these, thanks all for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to smash that like. <laughs> Alright, so... Uh, by the way, if you did not know, you can tag these and whenever, whenever you tag them, uh, you can see them on the top right corner over there on your map. Oh, what's going on? So, top right corner on the map. So, complete an event. That's easy. All you gotta do is just do two events, such as Vitoga. I highly recommend doing it because I'll oh, wait. I'm gonna be speaking from a perspective of a low player. That is definitely no low low player section. Don't go there if you just started out and you're fresh from the vault. You can go to the public events or any of them actually if you see people around there because in that case they will complete the event for you and it will count. Your job is uh, your vault 76 which you just got out from the vault. So uh, the easiest way for you to get to events would be to trigger the workshop challenges. So all you gotta do is capture the workshop and then the event will start and uh, you will need to defend it and you defend it, it counts as one. So afterwards you navigate, capture one more, and you'll get it too. And you got one more over here, you can google all the maps of the workshops. Well, they're really nice because they give you some materials to build, and you can get some other materials while you're playing the game. And plus it will trigger some events all the time, it gives you rewards, plants, and stuff like that. Definitely recommend you doing this, and this really will help you to level up. So, uh, chew bubblegum, uh, you should have bubblegum as soon as you level up, because you get bubblegum as soon as you level up, and never sell bubblegums, don't drop them, don't sell them, keep them at all costs so you can complete these challenges without spending time. Now, if you don't have bubblegum, uh, you can get some from a collection for the fast match one I'm pretty sure uh, or you can do the daily challenges here, here at the Camden Park and you earn tokens then those tokens you can submit for bubblegum and also you can go and uh, to this location right here speak to Sweetwater that's a daily challenge uh, but you want to go inside the house that he is at and there is a store area in that store area you can find one bubblegum uh, definitely, and I also sometimes find bubblegum in Dolly Soul Wilderness, but that's no low low level player uh, area. Uh, drink Nuka Cola. That's also pretty straightforward. Your rise and shine to go to is Poseidon Energy Plant WV06. Uh, there is a lot of Nuka Colas out there. Uh, also, if you once you're entering to uh, Flatwoods, there is a Nuka Cola machine. If you see a machine, always make sure to pick up some Nuka Cola. Because these challenges are also always here, but a lot of them are here and inside. But I'm not sure will the enemies be high level for you after the uh, patch uh, Wastelanders came. I don't remember when exactly did they uh, make that the Poseid uh, Oh wait, what am I talking about? Jesus, my bad. Nuka Cola plan. That's what you need. My bad. I am do. <laughs> Lol. Outside, you can find some Nuka Colas, Cherry Nuka Cola, Quantum, regular Nuka Cola, 
and inside as well but I'm not sure if there's gonna be high levels in there or not but definitely you should find three and just drink them up and you're all good to go kill scores uh, the scores area would be the best one is Morgantown Airport that's where you can kill your scores level up is straightforward just level up and you're done join a player with another uh, join a group with another player open your menu go to the public teams find a, a, a public team that's already created and join that's it and that will work as well so afterwards uh, oh wait there we go uh, da -da 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 -da. oh come on so then we have kill a cryptid you can go and kill a uh, grafton monster neither in this location Helmut Holmes and there are two Snallygasters they also count by the way or the easiest one and super easier for lower players would be the Charleston in Charleston you can find two um, Grafton monsters and two or three Snallygasters as well and they are much lower level than up there so this is your place to go to uh, mod a weapon three times by the way uh, you don't really have to mod and s s uh, like waste your resources you can put skins on them like uh, paints and it will work uh, buy or sell an item from another player well that's fairly straightforward just go to another player's camp and uh, simply um, one sec I just want to show you this real quick alright let's do this one Boom, you see? Boom. Boom. Done. So, for buy sell, you just go to another player's vending camp, find the vending machine, buy a bullet three times, and you're done. Yeah. So, you, you gotta just buy three things, and that's pretty much it. But bullets is cheaper and easier. So, Z Clan and everybody else, thanks all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, you know, drill, don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity, as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, I see them, I read them, and I delete them. So, if you have something negative to say, you can always provide it in a good manner. And uh, other people will read it and react to it as well. So, no F bombs, and you're good. If you're new to subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So, hi from Ukraine. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to join our uh, Discord channel, we have over 600 members. The link is down in the video description. All links are down in the video description, by the way, if you didn't know. <laughs> Including a tutorial in case if you did not know how to uh, navigate with Discord, since we'll play a lot of different games. Uh, we have a lot of different chats for different games, and in order to get access to them, you need to apply for a specific role, which is pretty easy. Uh, but if you still can't get it done, then uh, the tutorial video comes to the rescue. So, Z Clan and everybody else, once again, thanks all for watching. Y'all have a good one and day and night. Whatever you guys like it at, I'll see you later. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are Z Clan, we ever get.